Corby. These vows are just a little slice of what I consider to be our story together. So let's start from the beginning. Here's to love, here's to joy, here's to Aiden and Corby's future. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Aiden, I'm the groom. This is Corby, my bride, my beautiful bride, by the way. Um, I just want to thank everybody for coming out here. I know uh, the last year and a half has been really tough for everybody. <sighs> um, and it's just really special that you all decided to come out and celebrate with us. Eden, I'm so thankful for when our paths first crossed in sixth grade. I remember when I told you later in life that you were my first middle school crush. And I asked you if you had felt the same, and you replied, that's not fair, I don't even think I even liked girls yet. <laughs> <laughs> the first time I remember seeing you was at sixth grade orientation at St. Elizabeth Seton. I saw your name on the wall in the cafeteria, and my first thought was, Corby White, that's a funny name. Fast forward a few years to high school together at St. Thomas More. I remember having the biggest crush on you. Corby, trust me when I say that I did not think I would be marrying you today. I'm so thankful to have continued to be good friends throughout high school. It was fun finding your old senior picture that you had given me that read, Corby, I'm so glad we got to be such good friends these last few years. You're such a great person, teammate, and friend. I'm going to, <laughs> I'm really going to miss my AP Gov buddy next year. But it wasn't our time yet then either. A few years later, you made what I consider to be your best decision to date, transferring to USD. I remember we started off as just friends, but I'm glad that didn't last long. When I transferred to USD, I didn't know anyone. I was happy to have a familiar face to show me around. <laughs> And finally, it was our time. Timing is everything, and I'm so thankful for our many years of friendship to allow us to grow and experience life together. You're still my best friend and always will be. It's such a good evening to come together and enjoy the celebration of the beginning of Aiden and Corby's life together. Imagine someone better than Aiden to compliment and complete Corby. Watching Corby and Aiden interact and the way she is around him is something really special. Aiden knows exactly what to say or do to ever calm Corby down. I vividly remember our first kiss on New Year's Eve 2015 at your cabin in Deadwood. I was so nervous and I couldn't believe that I was lucky enough to be kissing you. Jeremy said even just six months into their relationship, Aiden was raving up to him about Corby and how he already knew that he was going to marry this girl. I still have those same crazy feelings about you today as I did in Estes Park. <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, you look so beautiful, me. Aiden and Corby, you've come a long way, and you have persevered, you have overcome a lot to get to this point. Not only did they do distance, which is hard enough in and of itself, but they were also 
individually exceeding in both of their fields. They are at the top of each of them. And you've achieved the highest honor at your respective universities in pursuing those professional degrees. And it's really quite impressive given the fact that they were traveling. Aiden would go to Omaha and then Corby would come to Sioux Falls. And it's really a testament to how loyal and loving and just absolutely dedicated they are to one another. The strength of your relationship, your resolve to spend the rest of your life together. You guys have both put in the work in your individual lives, in your relationships, and I absolutely cannot wait to see what you guys do uh, as a family and for your community because you two are incredible human beings and I'm, I am very honored to be your friend. We're here. This happened. Even though the buffalo tried to stop it. <laughs> but these people are here because of you two. Celebrating this. And it's incredible. I promise that I will always love you unconditionally. I promise to accept all of your imperfections, if there are any. Aiden, I promise to always be your teammate. Together we can get through all of life's challenges and celebrate all of life's victories. I'm so happy to have a life companion in you. Our paths were always aligned. And I'm so happy that it's you and me who get to do this life together. I consider myself to be the luckiest guy in the world today because you said yes. You're the perfect person for me, and I know I can trust you for anything. I promise to grow into a better man by your side. You'll always be my AP Gov, buddy. I love you so much, Corby Light. <laughs> now let's do this damn thing. Yeah, I'll pronounce you. I'll give me a